Hickaboos, what's up? Finally here today, Final Fantasy Talk, and today we're going to talk about some more Final Fantasy 15 discussion today. And as you see for a title, we're going to talk about annoying mini games in Final Fantasy 15. Now, if you didn't know, a week ago, Square Enix did announce their mini game in Final Fantasy 15 will be coming out on uh, smartphones next month in August. It's the pinball machine uh, with the Final Fantasy 15 or Final Fantasy monsters design and RPG elements, and you can play it uh, on your smartphone or tablet. And also, Square Enix will be releasing it on Windows 10, but only available in Japan. So, but basically, it's called Justice Monsters 5. A arrives on uh, smartphones in August and it's a pinball machine and you know it's just your typical pinball machine you know I don't know what else to say about it it's a mini game in FF15 that you can play on your phone now and it's a ping bong ball machine I don't know why I keep saying bong to be honest maybe <laughs> I don't know why but anyway it's a it's a mini game and uh, what I'm getting from this is you know yeah it's just a mini game it's something from FF15 early from FF15 FF15 that you can play on your phone now what I want to know from FF15 is later on in FF15 or just in general in 15 how will mini games work? Because you know, in general, in mini games and all of FFs, they're all bloody annoying. You know, there's not one good, like, really good hardcore mini game that people really like. That they, that people can all agree on anyway that they like. You know, for example, me. There's one mini game I really like, and it's Blitzball. I fucking love Blitzball, but so many people do not like Blitzball at all, and I don't get it because you know, as long as you learn the game and everything, it's really simple. But a lot of people don't like Blitzball. Okay, whatever. But in FF10, you know, doing the chocobo racing, the butterflies, the lightning bolts, or Final Fantasy 12, doing hunt by hunt by hunt by hunt by hunt, and then other things, and also, you know, the Ozma fight, and Final Fantasy 9, if you count that as a minigame or whatever. There's just a lot of stuff in FF in general that is very annoying to do, but you do get some good stuff from those mini games, you know, you get really great stuff from those mini games, and that's the whole point of the mini games. It's going to be challenging, annoying, and especially doing it over and 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 over again until you do it. That's how Square Enix makes their damn mini games, and especially in Final Fantasy 13 2, the freaking clock thing that you were forced to do. By the way, it was not an option. You know, you you were forced to do it over and over and over again unless and then, then there's another option if you want to do it to do 100% the game I did that but still in, in the story you were forced to fucking do the game and I swear that is my most annoying game in all of FF I hate the clock game even though that there is a clock app on you know 13.2 that you know solves the thing for you I didn't know about that okay but when I did not know about that and was playing the game, it was annoying. It was, I didn't get the whole fucking thing at all. But anyway, Kubo's in Final Fantasy 15, I do hope that there are mini games in there though. Even though they are really annoying and people are probably going to be like, why are you fucking dumb? I'm not dumb. I just think so. If you're getting something rewarded from that, like something really rewarded from that mini game, then why not do it? Let's come on, let's do it. You know, especially the, like the 13 side little mini uh, battles that you did that were fucking hard as fuck but you got so rewarded from it it was great and I think they should do more of that in Final Fantasy 15 maybe not hunts I don't really like the hunts I think they should go back to you know maybe FF10 mini games or maybe FF9 mini games or maybe FF7 mini games with the golden chocobo but get something really rewarded Square Enix really rewarded from that Please, but anyway, Kubos, you let me know in the comments below what you think about that. Do you think they should bring back annoying mini games in Final Fantasy 15? I think they should. Not a lot that you know that not a lot that you know that's going to be annoying because you know you want this really powerful weapon or something, and it's for and there's so many of them, and then every fucking thing they gotta do is a, a mini game to get that. Don't do all that, but you know you know a good five or six maybe. And uh, it's very rewarding. So anyway, Kubo, you let me know in the comments below if that should be in FF15. And uh, yeah, 
So, here we go, boys. Hope you enjoy that final mountains. Yeah, bye.